Nobody likes waiting in line, especially at the DMV. Well, there's a new plan to bring people in the upstate somewhat faster service. Our Alessandra Young explains. The DMV is placing kiosks in different grocery stores throughout the state of South Carolina. Now they're starting with three and one of them will be in the upstate. They say all of these kiosks will open in early November. Right now you have to go to the DMV for everything. But with these new kiosks, you will be able to get some services right at your fingertips. Things like registrations and registration stickers and those things. Executive Director for SCDMV, Kevin Schwedo, says the use will be limited at first. We're, we're getting them in there now. We're going to make sure that they're doing what they should be doing. Over time, he says they will eliminate all the brick and mortar establishments. But in the grand scheme of things, we want you to spend more time with the kiosk and less time with the DMV. Drivers I spoke with leaving the DMV say they waited between 20 and 30 minutes. The lines are okay. Could be better. And like the idea of just going to the grocery store or online. But I know there's a lot of people that would still rather, instead of maybe getting on a home computer or coming down here, would feel more comfortable going to a kiosk in their grocery store. So my parents, they both work like on the weekdays and stuff, so it's a little bit harder for them to be able to take off and they don't have the time, especially when the DMV closes at five. It's a lot easier to know what I'm doing, especially just driving a couple seconds down the road to my local grocery store. Officials say the kiosks will be easy to use. It's going to go in and use it. It's going to be transparent to the store. The store will get a, a cut of the profits from the vendor and then the vendor will be responsible for loading the paper in there and those kinds of things. And it also would remind them if it's somewhere they frequent often, then they're going to see that and think, oh, I need to make those updates. or And maybe or less of a drive, yes. too. Schwedo says by this time next year, they hope to have an additional 50 kiosks and stores throughout the state, but that all depends on if people are using them. And Greer, Alessandra Young, 7 News. DMV says uh, the hours for the kiosks will be the, the same hours as the stores are open. They do not cost the state anything.